Guile is a character based heavily around his sonic boom. He has multiple moves that allow him to move about the screen, forward or backward, while still maintaining his charge for his boom, or his flash kick. Guile's sonic boom has a very fast recovery time, which means it cannot be punished as easily as many other fireballs in the game. However, the drawback here is that the time it takes to charge it up by holding back on the controller takes a little bit more than your average motion fireball and things of that nature. Guile's anti-air game is also top tier. His flash kick is the preferred method if you have charge built up, but crouching heavy punch works as well and is your go-to in most situations, even though it's more likely to trade and does less damage, the fact that you can do it any time without a charge means it's his main utility anti-air. Throw in standing medium kick and his air throw and he can anti-air most spots on screen if he correctly anticipates what the opponent is going to do. Guile's game plan often revolves around him chucking booms out to frustrate the opponent and getting them to jump so he can utilize one of the best anti-air arsenals in the entire game. Because his sonic boom recovery is so short, players will often get frustrated and do foolish things when trying to break through his defenses. Guile's medium button, specifically crouching medium kick and holding back or forward while pressing medium kick, give him a consistent way to check the opponent so they cannot hold forward in neutral and just walk right into the range where you don't want them to be. Crouching medium punch is his main combo button, and you can hit it twice to perform a target combo, which you can still cancel out of into a special or super moves. He also has a ton of command normals that are for specific situations and spots on screen. While Gal doesn't have a plethora of special moves, the attacks he has do a very good job of putting him in positions to succeed. Breaking down Guile's defense is something even seasoned Street Fighter players can struggle with at times, and giving him too much space will often result in getting a lot of booms thrown your way, which is something you don't want to have happen when you're playing against Guile. Guile is best played from a range where the opponent lacks options to deal with his moves, and this is often right around the distance of his crouching medium kick all the way out to full screen. Guile doesn't often want to be point blank against the opponent unless he's doing a combo or has a clear advantage. Making people consistently deal with the Sonic Boom Barrage is often where Guile players find the most success. If you're struggling with which combos and tactics to use for Guile, I highly recommend going to CFN and finding players around your level, maybe a, a spot or two above you, and looking at their match footage and seeing what combos and tactics they're using. Because if you look at players that are too high level, too far above your, your grade, you might not understand everything that's going on in the matchup. But if you find a player that's just a few steps above you, you can often learn quite a bit of information from that match footage.
you're done. 